And Lady Bulldogs will start this. And point for Dixon, so they'll be the first one on the board. Back to the Lady Bulldogs. That is short. So, point for Bell. We will go the other way here. Nice. Hit there. Back over the net again. And penalty against the Bulldogs, so that will put the ball back to the Tigers. 2-1 Bell currently here. Tigers are going to serve. I'll do some camera movement here to try to make some things look a little better. Three to one bell right now. And that is on the line. Bell will take a I don't know if my score is right here. I think we have a score issue. That will go back to the Tigers. Okay, so nine to five. So nine to five on the scoreboard here. I guess I don't know what happened there, but. Big hit. That is too far. That'll make this a 10 to 5 score here. And that is. I believe it's motioned in. So it's going to be ruled as out. And big block by the Lady Bulldogs to keep this alive. Doing some tweaking here, seeing if I can make this look a little better here. Checking the score there. It's 11 to 6 sticks in off the score. Oh, and a rotation here waiting on some things, but we're about ready to go again. And Bell will double the score again, 12 to 6 here.
That is out. So point to the Bulldogs. Point back to the Tigers. 13-7 now. Tigers still on top. They are in the black. We're going to have a illegal substitution here for a minute. And Bell once again with the serve. Is out. It's no return, but no need to. Out of play there. Bell again. Once again, time 14 to 7. They have doubled up the score again. Turn out of bounds this time off Bell. Sweaty Bulldogs with the serve this time. And double hit. Point goes to the Bulldogs. Point again, Bulldogs. We have a four-point matchup here. Following this, Bell and Plato will face off against each other. And another penalty, so three-point game now. Dixon with potential here. going to be out. So Dixon did not touch it, so two-point game now. Dixon on a roll here. Mostly mistakes coming off of the Tigers, but they're going to make this a one-point difference. So down by seven before this. They have come back on a six- Serve streak, but that will end 15 to 3 now. They go to 21. Good big block by Dixon there. Lady Tigers have to get it over. They do. Spike, we're going to have a violation on the Bulldogs, so Tigers will get the break on that, 16-3. to three. And point Dixon, so two-point game once again. 21 for one on the rotation just getting everything sorted out here so apologize if things aren't working Dixon down by two 
That is a ace right there on the hit. So I believe that's the second ace that Dixon has had. First real nice one like that, at least. Now we are knotted up here at 16 each. Dixon heading back. 16 all. You have to win by two. Bell can't track it down. Lost in the air, so Dixon will take the lead. 17-16. That is a violation on Bell. A two point lead for the Lady Bulldogs. Now, these two teams will face each other eventually here. Timeout, and we'll be back in one minute with more volleyball. So, back here again, ready to collect the serve. I was told there would be three sets, but there may only be two. We'll find out as soon as we get all the updates. Short serve, nearly an ace, but close enough. Can't make the return. That is 16-19 now. Dixon again still on top. I want to thank Stephanie Rome for making this happen. Ace again for the Bulldogs. Twenty sixteen now. Time is controlled by the Tigers. And trying to get him reaching over the net. Point going to go to the Tigers, though. They had a little more control over that. Collected by the Tigers and Dixon 21-17 now. I believe first one to 25. It's a four-point cushion for the Bulldogs right now. Checking on the rotation here down by the net. Good serve, Bell with the dig, and 22 17 now. Dixon just three serves away here from a first set victory. And big spike over the net. 23-17. Five points separate the two here. Oh, actually six separate the two, but some difference. 23. 24 now. Dixon... One point away, so an error on Bell or something of that nature, then Dixon in a good position right now. Bell able to field that. 
Kicks in a little high, a little volley over the net. Tigers. Point Dixon, that will do it. Bulldogs first set, we'll be back in three minutes with set number two. Good serve, can't get the ball over the net. Dixon will get the first points of the second set here and they will, so it looks like they both start with four is what's happening. Can't tell you why that's happening, but we'll just go with it. Bell with the point. They're going to knot it up at five each. And maybe something to speed the time up a little bit here with three sets maybe or something. I'm not completely sure. Five, Dixon on top by one. We apologize for that one camera. I will work on a better webcam similar to this one. That's gonna be unable to wrangle in and seven to five Bulldogs on top. Served by the Tigers, seven to six. Dixon still on top. Bell with the serve coming up. Once again, we'll be here next week on Thursday for baseball against the Newburgh Wolves from Dixon. And Friday night, the Waynesville Tigers will travel to Parkview for a Ozark Conference matchup against the Vikings. And we are knotted up here at seven apiece. That is point to the Bulldogs, and they will get the serve also. In one point lead currently in this matchup. That is out. Nine to seven, Dixon on top. I believe it's two out of three is the winner. So if Dixon wins this, that will be the end of the first set. Bell and Plato will be next following this. Point goes to Bell. Looking for a call in the net there. No call. So nine to eight. Tigers trail by one. I have the serve. And able to get it under control, but can they get over the net? They do. Still in play. Bell into the net, so Point Dixon, I believe it was already out of control before that point, but Dixon 10 to 8 lead right now. Substitutions on the Bell side. Have this live for 
since it's supposed to be live, we will have this updated here as soon as I can get it uploaded on the internet. I believe that is two quick strikes for the Bulldogs. Double aces in a row. Let's see if they go for a hat trick here. Serves it. It's going to be out. And that one's out, so trade of points there, one for one. 13 and 9. Dixon on top. Number one now coming up to serve. Want to thank all of our sponsors for Dixon here. Some new ones, Gan Johnson Insurance. Just added today. Along with Home Plate Grill, thank you for helping make this happen. The Dixon School District and Stephanie Rome. 14 points for the Lady Bulldogs. Is too much mustard on that. Fifteen to nine. Also got some plans down the road. We got do have some volleyball scheduled. Also several matches, possibly districts. Let's see what happens as the season goes along. Please support all these local businesses here. That have helped to make everything happen, though. Dixon, 16-9 now. Seven-point lead once again. Last time they came back from a seven-point deficit, and it was enough to give them the victory in the end. That is going to, I was going to say, going to be a point for Dixon, but... Wasn't officially done yet. And we have a time out. I believe it's on Bell. We'll be back in one minute. Back here, 17-9, Dixon on top. Mid-range serve there. Pretty good angle on it. Dixon. We're going to have a violation, so... Still a seven-point difference. Back to the Tigers, so six points separate the two teams now. Dixon still has a victory, though, so this will not end with just a... Uh... If Dixon wins, this will be over. If Dixon does not, then it will still have another chance here. There we go. Camera didn't want to switch its properness. So, point for Bell. Several, a couple subs coming in for the Tigers. Number four with the serve. So all the playoff action this year on Misha.tv as usual. We are an affiliate of them, so be sure to check them out. If 
five point difference now. Last serve went in favor of the Tigers again. Should be Dixon ball there. It is. It's waiting on who's going to get it. 19 13. Dixon still on top though. Number 20 with serve. And the Bulldogs close to the ceiling, able to save it. Big serve by Dixon. Back at that real quick. Ah, I made a boo-boo. We'll fix my boo-boo. Tried to do a replay and uh, apparently only camera one is on replay. Twenty-one to thirteen now though. Dixon on a roll at the moment. There will be an eight-minute intermission between these two. Sorry about the camera. I'm ace by the Bulldogs. Twenty-two, thirteen. Down the net, six point difference. Is it six? It's an eight point difference. The cameras are not matching up well. Back from the far corner there for Bill. And two points away for Dixon from picking up a shutout victory to start this jamboree. Currently have a one set lead, 21 in for one. Bringing in some extra height for the uh, Bulldogs. Violation, Dixon, point. It's a game point here, 24 points to 14. It'd have to have a perfect set of 11, the Tigers would, in order to win this and make this matchup continue. That is out. 25, final score. 25, 14, 25, 7. Start with an ace. So as usual, we'll add our four points to everybody. And Bell so far. Good job back and forth. And Bell will take that point several times back and forth. Tigers number, I think it's number four. Point back to the Bulldogs. Error on the serve. Dixon, big spike, that is in. 
seven to five Bulldogs on top. I believe it was ruled dead. Yeah, it was ruled dead before that. the little tip over trying to get the little feather roll not quite there and that is no good point bulldogs three point lead we have a time out here. Checking something here. discussion here. We're going to take a well, we'll just stick with it here. I'm going to try to change the setting. This uh, conference about a rule there. I'm not sure what the complication is, but We're back on track here. Good high serve. Big spike. Big dig for the Tigers. And Dixon can't return it. Point goes to Bell. Here, as I mentioned, Dixon will automatically win this. There we have a two-set lead. It is off the Lady Bulldogs. We are knotted up at nine apiece now. take a one point advantage in this third set. Good for a tied up ball game here, 10 to 10.
Swimmer 12 coming in for the serve. Officials also learning here, so it's an educational experience for everybody. Soft serve, Dixon, too far, point to the, oh, never mind, point to Dixon, it looks like. Oh, nope. We had an okay. We had an official that said that was Dixon, but it was past the line. So it is okay. Tigers with the point, and they will serve. And Dixon will get it back, and we're knotted at eleven again. Normally the third serve is, I believe, 15 when it was out of three. Now it's out of five during the regular season, so. Trying to see what the rule is here pretty quickly, I'm sure. Doing a great job so far. That one gets away from the Tigers. We are knotted up at twenties here in this close final set. Tigers, little tip. going to be behind the line. Dixon will take the lead back, 13 to 12 here. And point Tiger, or Point Bulldogs, 14 to 12. Out of the serve, the Libro for the Tigers. This time, number zero zero. Bell and Bland, a joint school district. Bland, the middle school. That is out. Tigers. We'll tie this back up. Ball into the net, I believe, on the Tiger side, so it will be a Dixon score. 15-14, Bulldogs on top. Number 20, the 
Goldie Bray for the Bulldogs coming up. Getting a lot of echo here, so doing my best for the audio. If you've watched some basketball, you would understand. Good save there to get a hand up by the Tigers. 15 all. Number four on the serve. Bell able to wrangle that down. Quick lob over the net for Dixon. Sets up for the spike. And we're going to have a point going to Dixon. Fault on the Tigers. Johnson Insurance, Stephanie Rome. Dixon School District, that is going to fall in the hole. We're knotted up again. Also, Home Plate Grill, awesome place to get food if you need here in town. I believe it is still Bell Ball. They ball just ran away from him. Tigers with the one point lead here. They are in black. And big spike by the Tigers there. Quick look at that real quick here. Up in the air and down. That is out on the Dixon side. A little too much on that. One point lead currently for Bell. They'll get a two point lead now. Showing for both these teams so far. First two sets, 25 to 17, 25 14 Dixon. Tigers showing a little bit in here now, trying to walk away with a victory. They'll face Plato next. And that will all go back to the Tigers again. So 2017 now, three point difference. Tigers. <laughs> Not quite a camera on that one. That was in that dead zone over there. Back to Bell, though, as neither Bulldog could really control that. Awkward angle, and it was gone. Dixon will be back in one minute with more. Dixon, good save. Dig on that anyway. And unable to get a hold of that. 23-17. Looking like the Tigers going to walk away with the final set here. But Dixon already won this. 
Bell points should go to Dixon there as the ball got held against the net. Slutty Bulldogs are going to need a not perfect run, but they're going to need a pretty good streak here to go. Give up two points, the game is over. And now it is one point, so game serve for the Tigers. from Dixon, 25-18. Next up, Bell and Plato. We'll see you in three minutes. Shot up. Oh, 